most important question of integration. Let us see the question. The question is 0 to 5 by 8 10 square 2x integration is equal to. For this type of question, see. So first this is 0 to pi by 8. At 10 square x you can write sec square x minus 1. So this is sec square 2x minus 1 and dx. You know integration of sec square x is 10x. So this is 10 2x and coefficient of 2x is x is 2. So this is 10 2x by 2. And again this is minus 1. So integration of minus 1 is x. And now it is upper limit and lower. So upper limit is what? Pi by 8 and this is 0. So put the value of upper limit you will get 10 2x. So this is 10 2 into pi by 8 and divided by 2. And this is minus x is what? Pi by 8. Okay. And minus this is the 0. So this will become 0 and this is also 0. So this is minus 0 and plus 0. Right. Now we can write this is 2. 2 4 ja 8. So this is 10 pi by 4 by 2. So this is 10 pi by 4. Okay. And this is 10 pi by 4 by 2. And this is minus pi by 8. Okay. And it is this. So we know 10 pi by 4 is what? 1. So this is 1 by 2 minus pi by 8. So when we solve this, so LCM is what? That is 8. So 2, 4, 4 minus pi by 8. 8. This is your right answer. So 4 minus pi by 8. A option is the correct answer. See the question. The question is I here given assertions. A we can write sin verse A is equal to sin h to the power minus 1. And regions given any value in the range of principal value branch is called principal value of that inverse trigonometric function. Now we have to find option. A is what? Both A and R true and R is the correct explanation of A. Second, both A and R are true but R is not correct explanation of A. A is true but R is false. A is false but R is true. So for this question you know we sign words A does not equal to sign H to the power minus 1. So this is false. So our correct answer is A is false, but R is true. This is the correct answer. See the question. Question is, find the value of 10 inverse 1 plus cos inverse minus half plus sin inverse minus half. So you know 10 inverse 1 is what? That is pi by 4. It is clear. Cos inverse minus half. You can find like this cos inverse minus half equal to theta. Then cos theta equal to what? Minus half. You know cos 60 is half. So this is minus cos 60 that is what? Pi by 3. Now you know minus cos theta can be cos pi minus pi by 3. So pi minus pi by 3 is what? Cos 2 pi by 3. So here cos inverse minus half will be what? That is 2 pi by 3. So this is 2 pi by 3 plus. Now we know this is sine inverse of minus half and sine inverse minus. So sine 30 degrees half. So minus half. So this is minus pi by 6. So this is what? Minus pi by c. So you can solve this question like this. LCM is 4, 3, say. So 2, 2, ja 4, 2, 3, ja 6. So 12 is LCM. Now 4, 3, ja 12, this is 3 pi. 3, 4, ja 12, this is 8 pi. And 6, 2, ja 12, this is 2 pi. So 8, 3, uh, 11 minus 2, 9 pi. So this is 9 pi by 12. So 3, 3, ja 9, 3, 4, ja 12. So correct answer is what? 3 pi by 4 is the right answer. Let us see the question. The question is what? Check if the relation on R on the set A given defined as Rxy where Y del Y X. 
इमेट्रिक और ट्रांजेटिव यू नो सिमेट्रिक इज वॉट जस्ट लाइक वन टू टू वन सो हेयर एक्स वाई सो सपोज दे रीज है वन टू बिकॉज एक्स वाई मीन वाई डिविजिबल बाई एक्स सो दिस इज वाई डिविजिबल बाई सो वन टू डेट इज टू डिविज बाई वन बट टू वन इज नॉट पॉसिबल बिकॉज वन इज नॉट डिविजिबल बाई टू सो इट इज नॉट सिमेट्रिक फॉर ट्रांसलेटिव वन टू यानी टू इज डिविजिबल बाई वन एंड यू कैन राइट टू फोर फोर इज डिविजिबल बाई टू सो वन टू एंड टू फोर सो इट इज सिमेट्रिक सो राइट आंसर इज नॉट सिमेट्रिक इट इज ट्रांजेटिव क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन इज असरसन ए टू क्रो टू बाई टू मैट्रिक्स ए वे इक्वल टू ए आई जे हुज एलिमेंट्स आर गिवेन बाई ए आई जे आई टू जे इज दिस A reason are if a is four into two matrix, then the elements in a is five. So we have to choose the answer from this option. Both a are a and r are true, and r is the correct explanation of it. Both a and r are true, but r is not correct explanation of it. A is true, but r is false, and a is false, but r is true. So we know here two by two matrix. This is two by two matrix. A i j. So this is a one one. So a one one so one into one one right. This is the a one two first row second column so one into two two. This is two one so two into one two. This is two 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 into two four so this is the correct. Now reason four into two eight but here written five so that is reason is wrong. So our correct answer is a is true but r is false. C is the correct answer. The question. The question is x equal to a cos theta and y equal to b sin theta. Find d square by by d square. So first you find d by by d. So a uh, d x upon d theta equal to what a into differentiation of cos theta is minus sin theta. So this is minus sin theta. So this is minus a sin theta. In the same way. d y y d theta so equal to what b and differentiation of sin theta is cos theta now we have to find d y y d x so d y y d x equal to what that is d y y d theta and into d theta by d x so d y y d theta is given b cos theta into d theta by d so d x by d theta is this so d theta by d is reciprocal so minus One upon a sine theta. So correct answer is what minus b by a cot theta, right? Now we have to find d square y by d x square. So d by d x of minus b by a cot theta. So you know this is constant minus b by a. And differentiation of cot theta is what minus cos x square theta. And again, with respect of theta, this is d theta by d x. So correct answer will be minus into minus plus. So this is b by a cos x square theta. And d theta by d x we can write minus one upon a sine theta. So we can write minus b by a square, and this sine theta reverse cos theta. So this is cos x square theta into cos theta into cos theta. So correct answer is minus b by a square cos q theta. See the question. The question is what? Find magnitude a a vector, magnitude of b vector. If magnitude of a vector equal to twice the magnitude of b vector, and a vector plus b vector dot a vector minus b vector is twelve. So we know a vector plus b dot a minus b is what? Magnitude of a square my in minus magnitude of b square. This equal to twelve. Magnitude of a vector given twice the magnitude of b. So this will be what? Four of magnitude of b square, and this is magnitude of b square equal to twelve. So we will get three of magnitude of b square twelve. So three four is twelve. So magnitude of b vector equal to two. Now we have to find magnitude of a vector. This is twice of magnitude of b vector. So two into two four. This is the correct answer.